Hi guys, I'm Except Chaos and welcome back to another episode of Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. We are progressing well and I'm really enjoying this game. I am so much enjoying it. It seems like we're running out of wood here, but I think there's still a... F oh, it's actually stopped working because everything is full. Look at that. Lots of unprocessed wood. You know, wood everywhere. So this guy is saying, well, it's got its 50 tons over there. This guy has got like its... Um, 60 tons available and is exporting 50 tons to the boards um, and this one is got its 330 tons of boards so lots and lots of boards okay so there is so there is still plenty of wood out there to be collected the last thing we did oh, i think we're now in a in a spot where we've got quite a nice little setup over here with basic resources for construction so for instance i can show you that if we say we want to build a gravel road okay gravel roads they don't actually show us what is necessary so let's find a spot where we're gonna need to do some more gravel roads um can we actually do a little something like this i uh, don't know don't know if we want to necessarily do something like that um where do we want to expand to i want to show you how we build a road uh you know what we could do i think what we could do is we can do a piece like that uh, and we don't want to auto build it it's definitely don't auto build it it kind of says it there we go 11 tons of gravel and 40 work days for us to do that piece over there so if I do that okay we're not gonna build it straight out what we're gonna say is we're gonna assign the construction of that road huh? I'm sure it should be able to really if I click on it, get out of here. If I click on this, honestly, it doesn't want to do it. Something's wrong. Assign new construction. You have to be able to. I'm missing stuff to be able to do it, right? Okay, hang on. Let's quickly have a look over here. Most important topics, roads, railways, and pathways. Connection. Hang on. Let's go to construction. Do we have construction somewhere? Gaining resources, something about citizens, power management, construction without money. Yeah, we, how to construct, raise, lower, flatten, using construction office, uh, not railways. Okay. Construction with connection by footpath only, construction by uh, of conveyance. Okay, let's just see. Con using a construction office. So there's a little bit of information available, but not too much. Construction offices are required to create buildings without spending any of your money. On top panel, click construction and select the construction industry. Choose the construction office. After the construction office is built, open the window. You can then specify sources for resources and purchase vehicles. You are now ready to assign construction. Click, um, click on the specify or replace source building and you can assign a source building. Source building store resources for construction, for example, gravel. Um, concrete bus platform for workers construction office will then automatically send vehicles to take resources from the source buildings and deliver them to construction sites click on the purchase vehicles button to purchase exact uh, to purchase vehicles exact vehicles required depends on the type of construction but you'll need buses dumper trucks open hull trucks um, open uh, concrete mixers and eventually cranes buses dumper trucks open hull trucks okay uh, concrete mixers and eventually crane. So I need, I think I need open hull trucks, but I don't think you can assign um, construction button to assign construction or if a construction office is idle, it will search and automatically help finish construction. Okay, so it seems like it should be working. Okay, so why? Sources of resources for workers and construction. That's fine. Uh, what I do need, however, is an open an open hull truck so we'll get ourselves something that can carry a fair bit is that kind of like what we want maybe that one woods and boards and I think that's the one we want Ooh, or this one but well, that's a little slower anyway we'll grab that one okay so now we've got a fair number of things over here but what I don't quite get it's is powered is it powered enough auto search shall we 
increase that area construction office um, I want to be able to assign this piece of construction why is this not considered construction shall I further continue this what is that start construction of planned infrastructure oh okay oh, I see that's what it is so we'll do that and we'll say start that construction and I believe the construction oh there it goes chaos grad unfinished road so immediately what we're going to see is it's it's audited there it goes it's going to go and grab some workers perfect I like it so what do we need over here we need 71 tons of gravel and 249 work days and they'll do it so what I'm going to I'm very keen on actually tracking the progress of our new con road construction over here building is on fire hang on hang on pause 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 where flats prefab chaos grad um, residential really no firefighters were sent no fire station in the rain citizens may be in peril medical service need to be prepared for serious injuries no nearby hospitals were alerted no hospitals within the range ah where I don't actually see the fire but yes one of the very next things we need to do is most certainly build before we do anything else we need some kind of fire station where is it fire station has to be over here somewhere fire station um, I don't think we've got everything in place to actually build it so what we'll do is we'll just in my mind what we're gonna do is we're just gonna we're just gonna kind of build it auto build it with rubles this one we're just going to auto build with rubles where can we place it I'm not going to place it there where it's going to mess up everything else hmm we are a little stuck for placing this is why you don't need you don't you shouldn't be building roads beforehand maybe this is what we want to do and go now we won't build further but this building is supposed to be on fire and I don't actually see it right oh there it is it's coming where's my fire trucks quick 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 and I need to buy a truck straight away straight away come on uh, purchase immediately go We need firefighters. Come on, guys, go and work there quickly. Someone needs to go and work there. Oh, yeah, 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 he's going. We're gonna have one. There's another. Excellent. There they go. Let's purchase ourselves one more. So I'll have like two fire trucks over there. excellent at least we have firefighters on scene now the question that I'm wondering about this is still not done anything do we need any mechanisms to construct this I don't think so have we sorted the oh, fire extinguished my goodness due to our brave firefighters and their most excellent fire trucks we were able to extinguish the fire oh perfect okay now things are underway here we've got workers on site but we are missing gravel. Oh, we're loading gravel. We may need multiple dumper trucks, I believe. So let's look into getting multiple dumper trucks at least. Dumper vehicles, please. Um, I want the big boys. Uh, let's just get that one. Uh, fine now we've got multiple dumper trucks what is that oh that's just the open hole yeah it's fine get the dumper truck to bring in stuff because there's workers on site over here and the bus keeps bringing more I think yes more no I don't know not really right just 11 but here comes the first piece of um, of gravel being dumped over here so let's have a look 
Oh, look at that. Interesting little, little piece. So I would imagine with workers on site and why are you not going back for more for more gravel this is it does take a long time to do it this way are we seeing oh there's only two workers on site now so the progress is pretty slow here do we need i am quite keen for us to make sure that this thing is kitted out with all the right stuff that it needs so let's go back here construction from resources without money um construction raise lower flatten using construction office start stop construction yeah so that's the bu buttons that i need to be pushing um construction phases ah here we go there are many construction phases like groundwork steel laying brick laying etc every phase requires different resources and vehicles the most common requirement is workers all phases require manpower to finish eventually instead of manpower um, workers you can use vehicles Ooh. excavator asphalt diver roller um, etc can completely replace manpower so each construction phase could be compl uh, completed without any workers present on the construction site Ooh. so what do we what is the one see i don't know too much about construction asphalt paver no excavator maybe a roller i don't think so um, so maybe yeah what we need to do is get a bit of an excavator potentially maybe we should purchase an excavator see how that goes for us let us do that let's purchase an excavator and see what happens if the excavator actually comes out over here to do some stuff yeah it's coming there it's coming so the excavator can actually help that out construction of railways is something we'll get into later construction connection some constructions for example playgrounds or statues are not possible to connect to a construction office by road those constructions need to be connected uh, to road via uh, one or more footpaths to connect those buildings with no possible connections to the construction office to a uh, road via footpath footpaths can directly connect to roads as pedestrian crossings and then buildings can be assigned to the construction office okay so we'll bear that in mind so we continue to get workers here and i believe we've got an excavator that is extremely slow that's making its way over here but yeah so we're actually starting to do our very own construction we've got we're still waiting on we've got like a, a lot of uh, tons of gravel here but we're waiting on some more don't quite know why this guy actually goes back to the construction office before it goes um, and collects the gravel that feels like a bit of a problem to me so with the excavator around the construction should actually continue um, regardless of the um, of whether there's sufficient workers on site I think that's the case but I wish I knew what kind of mechanisms does stuff yeah here it is nice i believe we're progressing well and we're just waiting on sufficient gravel but anyway that just means that it's going to take so much longer to get stuff built but i but it's for free now <laughs> well not for free but pretty much for free we had to buy the equipment but the equipment will be be available for the next one so i like like us building our first little construction project over here um in order for us to continue construction i don't want to do go into the prefab industry but what i did want to go into was the um do we have a storage oh we have a storage for coal but not much else actually and so coal is not being we're not seeing lots of coal production actually occurring but we don't have a coal ore um storage that is occurring just see so we can actually get oh it's multiple outputs it's not multiple inputs which is um quite um strange i think okay what i want to do is i want to build yet another coal mine so let us grab ourselves some coal mines that's a bit of a coal mining area over here and over here but let's start off with this one um and of course we are going to want that conveyor to go out um in a direction that is sensible for us so something like this potentially is is about the right we'll do a little something like that
plop that one in there lost this one completely that's way too too poor uh, poor resource this one we will we will also use perfect so now we've got two extra coal mines probably not the best coal mines out there but they can do their thing I wanted to continue this road and then I wanted it to run through there from this angle wanted us to do that and I wanted us to do this so now we could consider a bit of a bus station over here and try and connect all of these things together and I think that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna do a small bus platform um, and try and connect it a little little something over here it is a little bit so we'll do that I'll click on it and we'll see well we don't have any road connections right now so what we'll do is I am thinking we'll do a bit of a gravel a gravel road connection like that Well, we don't have to do both sides so let's just leave the one side for now um, I'm gonna click this one again and then we're gonna have a look and see oh, we can't actually see how far that is so I'll have to start building these things so let's um, quickly come back over here and see how that road construction is going uh, yeah so it is quite slow we're still waiting on like 11 tons of gravel which I believe should now be coming in yeah that's our last pieces of gravel so our last pieces of gravel are coming in We've got a few workers around but not maybe not enough uh, I don't necessarily think we need all these firefighters what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna what is that what does this do oh I can sell it like that let's sell that vehicle yes thank you um, I don't want I, I think 12 firefighters is kind of more than enough we don't need all that others anyway this construction is underway we've got all the gravel we need we're potentially waiting on a little bit more workers but at least with the excavator there things are progressing so the excavator helps a lot for the road construction which is good okay coming back over here so I'm not gonna get our construction office to start building this road uh, at least not these first sections here um, so actually let's just go in uh, actually I can't build the entire construction can I ah what I can do hang on hang on, hang on. planning is on so what I'll do is I'll say yeah go ahead with that okay the construction office is not gonna come in and do this so what I'll do is I'll purchase this one I'll purchase that one I'll purchase up to this one and I'll purchase over here and what we'll do from there is I'll let the construction office come and build the rest of this road over here what is required for this we need asphalt gravel all these kind of things um, what I'm interested in is if we can get the construction office to actually come and build it because we've got concrete we've got gravel we just don't have asphalt if we can then purchase asphalt so what I want to do is let's um, uh, let's assign the construction How far is this? I want to I want to see if we can can keep doing that. Okay, if I say assign construction, will it say that it is just too far away, or will it actually do it? It will actually do it. So the question is, things will start to be delivered over here, and what I want to see is if I can buy just the resources that are missing. Is it going? Yeah, there's the dump truck going. The bus probably needs to collect workers, but there's not a lot of workers hanging out over here. Maybe a few. We could probably do with some more people. We have no escape, so the people are actually kind of growing. Population is growing. People are pretty happy. We've got unemployed workers, so we shouldn't be building too much extra. Our gravel production is really going well. I don't think we have too much problems with quarried stone not coming in quick enough. 
Um, we're maintaining a fair bit of gravel tons over here. This thing should have stopped completely. Oh, no, no, it's not stopping because it's still this still a fair bit of cement that it can do. There is a concrete buffer with all of this cement stored up. So, yeah, we are slowly filling everything in. But, yeah, we couldn't use a little bit more coal. So, we will see some construction starting to happen over here. This one I'm just going to build outright. And then what we're going to do is we're going to put some, connect some of these little pathways. Like that. Well, let's forget about that for now. Let's just uh, build that little pathway over there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to say, well, how far can you actually walk to get there? Really? This one can't walk? That doesn't feel right to me. Oh, that's 280 meters over that way. So you can't, you can really not walk this way. Well, what I'll do, what I'll do, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to, I'm going to see about extending the pathway. Here to be a little bit more direct. And let's pay for that. And with that in mind, can we now actually get them there? We can get them there. Now it's a shorter path. <laughs> Excellent. So now what I'll do is this bus station will now um, we are going to add that bu uh, that bus station over there and we're going to remove this one. Excellent. So that should help us out a little bit. Uh, and we can slowly get construction to come and work on other pieces as well once that's finished. This should be close to done, right? We've got all of our resources. We have no workers on site, but at least the excavator is continuing to do the thing. I'm, I do think we're struggling a little bit to understand how exactly the workers work. So there's no workers available over there. We've got some workers, well, firefighters over here. I don't necessarily understand whether what the difference is between that. This side, we've got no workers over here, but there are passengers. So the thing that I was wondering a little bit about is should we purchase ourselves another bus that actually drives between the two bus stations. I want to do that and see what that actually does. So give me this bus. We will say you're coming here, you can get in and out everybody and then you're driving all the way to the other town over here and we'll see how that goes and you can start that journey. This is almost done. We'll see the conclusion of the opening of our new first built or self built road. I'm quite keen on it. We're using our last few uh, kind of 100 kgs of gravel and concluded. Our new piece of road is up and running. That's the opening of our new road. That is really cool. So that was a nice direct connection towards our, our new little town over here. So this guy, I believe, is heading to Chaos Grad. And we've got workers on board see this is what f so there are passengers waiting i just don't know what they're doing so we're sending workers to chaos Grad, which wasn't quite the purpose of the the whole thing here comes construction construction workers are actually walking to the site i believe um resources needed so i believe some gravel should be on its way yeah i think that's all the gravel uh, do we have a concrete mixer that's going to bring us concrete as well? It could potentially already be on its way. So I'll check the whole route. Yeah, here it comes. Here comes the concrete mixer. Oh, and that's the excavator moving over there. Okay, well, interesting. We've got workers on site. We just don't have anything else on site. The gravel will arrive sh soon. That'll be all the gravel and I believe all the concrete is coming. So, excellent. I love the fact that we're getting our, our stuff ready. Can they start building or they do need all the resources on site? So, can I purchase certain resources? Fund I don't want to fund construction. Decrease the number of workers. Can I just purchase the asphalt? And that is a, a fair and open question. Can I come to the construction office and say we've purchased missing resources? Um, the concrete plant can't produce concrete. The asphalt plant is not assigned as a source. 
So can I say under asphalt? Yeah, so that's a bit of a problem. I think that's not going to work. We're going to need to have all the resources in place. So what I'll do is I'm going to finish this one with rubles. I know it's kind of against what I wanted to do. Uh, if I put the resources in there, it should have, it would have worked. They would have used that first. I should have just done that. I should have just done that. Uh, let's uh, cancel the contract. Continue construction. Where is my um, Where's my concrete mixer? Oh, actually, okay, fine. Let's just finish it. Let's just finish it. No need to worry too much. I thought it was going to come and drop some stuff up. So at least we put some gravel on there. It's getting boards and everything. Resources need to finish. I can't remember it being part of it. Oh, maybe it was part of what the vehicles were that we had in place. And I didn't actually check to see what all this stuff was. Anyway, it's fine. Continue the construction. From that, what we want to do is we then want to also go into uh, bricks. Bricks, bricks, bricks. Bricks is what we wanted. So go to the construction industry. We wanted a uh, asphalt plant creates... A gravel and bitumen so we would need um, we would need an oil refinery to get that done so what do we do here we wanted a brick thing right rail construction gravel so where is the brick one uh, what uh, actually what we could do is we could actually um, assign this construction so that we can get those guys to come and construct the rest of this road let us do that uh, this office, since this office is not doing anything, I'll, const uh, I'll assign this piece of road to them so they can start sending sending guys over to do that. Uh, what I wanted to do now is actually get the brick stuff going on. Concrete asphalt uh, brick factory. So the brick factory has some open storage space for the imports and the exports. Okay. Um, it produces 51 tons of bricks from 33 tons of coal. So, all in all, what I need to, us to do is place the brick factory uh, just about here. Well, pretty close because we want people to be able to walk there, but they will be able to walk there. Excellent. The flattening of the terrain is going on. We'll place that in there and I will be going all out by constructing it straight away. But before that, we would want to connect it to a bit of a road over here. So we'll do a little something like that and we will construct that piece. At the same time, we will be wanting to do a bit of this pathway. Grab my grab me some pathway over there. Like that, we'll build that. And now we'll build this one with a ruble. So please construct that straight away. Ooh, the one thing I didn't check was the probably the most important of them all is can I get the conveyor connected? And I can. Luckily, I can get the conveyor connected. So build the conveyor. Thank you. How's the source look like? 5%. Building without a power supply? Okay, we'll, so we'll need to sort that out. You guys are still underway here. We'll build a bit of a power facility somewhere. There are some... Ooh, we have to split it off here, I think. If we want to uh, run it somewhere over here. Uh, can we power... Well, we don't need to power this guy. This guy is powered. What we'll need to do is we'll need to power over here somewhere. Construction here is underway, right? Still needing tons of stuff to happen. But yeah, let's set, set up our power supply over here. Power. With a bit of luck. Yeah, yeah, we can pick up all of them. Uh, 
So we'll do a little something like this. So we'll pick up all of those. Perfect. We will do so. Now, if I'm saying medium voltage switch is gonna... Yeah, we're probably gonna need a medium voltage switch somewhere over here. So let us go ahead and... Demolish one of these guys. Okay, we go and go for the medium voltage switch. Somewhere over here. Okay, now let us get these cables coming in and please auto build them with um, with the rubles, thank you. Nice, so now that's underway again. What we'll do is we will run power lines up here. Oh, say to up to about there. And we'll run it so like so. And what we'll do is we'll finish this piece with the, oh, that was actually not the one I wanted to finish, but that's the one. There we go. So now all of this should be powered. And with workers in place, we should... Uh, and this is not looking for... Oh, no, 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 no. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on, pause. I messed up. I messed up. This is a massive problem. This shouldn't have occurred here. The facility needs to go to the other side. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I messed it up. Okay, well, it's going to have to go. It's it's a bummer. It's going to have to go. It's really a bummer. I didn't want to want to do that. I wanted to plan better than that um so that we don't have this kind of issue. So let's go back. We'll see what we need is a brick factory and I believe the brick factory can potentially function over here. Hmm. It's not great in the sense that it's going to grab from the aggregate, which is over there. Alternatively, what we can do is we can run it in from this side. Uh, that's probably better. That's probably better. And we can do a little bit of a bus station over here. Or we can feed it from over there as well. Anyway, I think if we build it over here. No! No! Oh, it's because I'm building it from rubles. That's why I'm not flattening it with my own excavators. And that's also a bummer because I haven't actually checked yet again whether this thing can, can do that connection. But luckily it can. We should switch that off straight away. Uh, so I gone and messed that up. Well, and now we've got a bit of an issue over here. Switch on my wireframe so I can just see what's going on here. Okay, let's get that a little better. That should be fine. And now we should be able to, to, to get it in there. Perfect. Uh, let's do that construction. That's okay. What we'll do is we'll get a bit of a bus station going on somewhere over here. But there we go. So now we've got a brick factory in here as well that's going to use um, the tiny bit of coal we have over here. So what we'll need to do is we actually need to, and hopefully we can, oh, we've lost that entire conveyor. Um, and the question is, do we start trucking stuff over here as well? Or do we just try and get it into the conveyor? I think we just get it into the conveyor. Okay, guys, I think I'm going to put a cut in this episode. In between episodes, what I'm going to do, um, because this isn't actually doing anything and we don't have any workers over here yet. Uh, what I'm going to do in between episodes, I'm going to set up the extra conveyor um, so that we can get a little bit more coal to get in on that side. Okay, thank you so much for watching. Is this construction project underway at all any one of them okay well thank you so much for watching we'll figure that out in the next episode if you've liked it hit the like button and i'll see you next time bye bye